got a super late start. Got a big day though. Good thing out with JP. Start this vlog off. What are you doing, brother? The famous JP. That's me. Mm. What's up, brother? You? Got JP. We're at lunch. I'm so, on the lake. Starting our first vlog today. Just getting a little stuff organized for uh, um, for the podcast. Right, right. right. Got it going. Yeah, I had Super checking excited. out my life. Beautiful day here in Oklahoma City. So, tell us... Tell these guys what the podcast is going to be all about, man. This podcast is going to be unique because we're going to be looking at disability issues from all angles. We're going to enlighten everyone on what life is like with a disability and what life can be like. We're going to look at some of the misconceptions, some of the barriers perceived and otherwise that people in wheelchairs face and people with other disabilities. It's going to be exciting. We're going to bring up topics that people want to talk about but have been afraid to. We're going to bring those up. We're going to talk about fun stuff, sports, uh, good times, travel, uh, business, work, success. We want to, to bring the quality of life to the forefront for people with disabilities. It's not awareness. Yeah. Not awareness. It's, it's time for people with disabilities to be recognized along with every other minority as for the contributors they are to the yep. great country of America. Yep. Well, and, and uh, you and I have been friends for... Oh, a long time. I don't even know now, what, over 10 years? Over now. 10 years. 10, uh, known JP for at least 10 plus years. Yeah. We kind of run around together, got some group of friends we call the Wolf Pack. Uh, we had some great adventures. Yeah, we had some fun, had some fun. Yeah. But um, we're just starting to vlog off and we're hitting lunch up today just to yak about some stuff. So. That's right. Don't screw it up, Jay. Rubby a shotgun seat. See you, brother. Hey, man. See ya. All right. What's up, man? What's up, big guy? Hey. All right. Yell at me later. All right, successful uh, meeting with JP. Uh, Got some stuff kind of lined out, and just wanted to make sure you introduce you to him. He's a key component of the podcast, and has some really cool views. So um, that's it. Jason. Dude, that's a really good job. Did you did you solve the puzzle? I just slept in there for the hours. I like it. Baba here. The stock. Real quick. Um, I gotta get used to this camera stuff. But um, you heard JP talk about it today and what uh, this podcast is uh, um, all about. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna have weekly vlog blogs. JP used to, when he was in college, he went for journalism and he can tell you that backstory later in our podcast sometime. But he went back, he went to uh, school for journalism so he's gonna write some weekly blogs. I'm gonna do vlogs um, several a week 
try to shoot for three or so. And basically, just to kind of give you an idea, this podcast is is, is devoted to uh, disabled, the disabled lifestyle, um, what's going on out in the world, how people function, how they live, what they do, controversial stuff. We're going to mix it up. You're going to hear different opinions. You're going to hear things that are going to piss you off. You're going to hear things that are that are um, um, that people need to talk about that we don't talk about. We're going to have all kinds of different cool stuff. So that's one thing that this podcast is going to do. It's going to bring to light a bunch of stuff. I've already set up about five or six interviews. I'm just starting a calendar. I'm working through the book, loading these people up. Guys that are spinal cord injury, CP, families, moms. I'm going to have um, I'm going to have different. Uh, um, different types of people, different diagnosis, different, all kinds of different things that we consider disabled. But we're gonna talk about things. We're gonna talk about things that people don't talk about. We're gonna talk about things that people don't know. See, here's the whole concept, is that after doing the type of work that I've done in over 20 years, I've built friendships. And, um, and what I've noticed is, it doesn't matter if you're in a wheelchair or you're not, if you're disabled or if you're not, um, you're either a good person or you're not. Um, you're, it doesn't matter. It doesn't matter. You're the same. And so that's the hard part is that people don't realize is that people are the same when they're disabled. They just want to be treated the same. And that's, I think I do that. What, you know, JP is just like today. We just sat down. Uh, we had stuff to go over, but then we just sat and hung out. And when we talked and today it was just like family, kids, wrestling, UFC, you name it. So I'm vlogging today, getting this all together, starting it off, first podcast, first vlog, excuse me. We're gonna have our first podcast coming up. Got a couple of guests lined up. First one will just be JP and I, and maybe another guy just sitting in here, shooting this, shooting this stuff, a conversation, figuring it out. So that's, but this whole vlog is dedicated to that world. And so I wanna hear from people, I want people you know, obviously post them down below, um, uh, emailing us. I want to hear stories. I want to hear your story. If either, you know, if you were born with a disability or you became uh, injured or you were diagnosed later in life, um, I want to hear it. I want to hear what you do. I want to hear your incredible stories. I want to hear um, things that are um, uh, mind blowing. And that's the thing, the motivational thing to get up and grind. See, that's the thing is like, Guys like JP, I got so many other ones, but I text him tonight, it's 8.45, and I'm like, um, don't forget about, we gotta put that, you're kind of like a bio thing on the, on the website. And he's like, I'm still with the kids, basically at practice. So it's just normal, you know what I mean? He gets up, he get, it takes him hour, hour and a half every morning just to get ready to go to work. I mean, today we were talking about his routine and what it's like, and it, it's mind blowing because people out there complaining all the time about their life and they have no freaking clue when people like this can get up and do it. I've known JP for, I don't know, 10, 15 years, and he gets up and he's done it every day of his life. He's worked every day of his life. He's figured it out, he's grind. He really, truly grinds. He did all these motivational tapes and all these people talking about, get up, do this, and do that. And I, and I love it. I listen to it, too. You know, Gary Vee, all these guys. They're my favorites. But honestly, P has to do uh, is he has to grind every day just to get up and do it. Just whether that's hanging out with his kids, you know, going to practices, going to work. Whatever it is, he's got to do it. I, I get goosebumps sitting here talking about it because it's so motivating. So I've noticed that over my years. Done this, been in this industry around disabled people for 25 plus years. My family owned a pharmacy when I was a kid growing up. I and mean, I've been around it. I'll tell my story more if you, as we go and you'll hear, hear about it. But I've been around it and uh, I've touched it. I haven't lived it, but I've touched it. I've been around it and I, and I, and I'm, I notice it and what I've been inspired by is the fact that these guys can get up and do it every day and, and they can do it without a complaint and they can do it without help 
and they can do all these amazing things and it makes me want to shut up you know I'm fortunate I'm very fortunate um, and so I it just changed the perspective of my life to see how these guys are these guys are like super motivational JP's one of my guys I mean he's one of my he motivates me man uh, if I start thinking about stuff I can't do man just think about what he's got to do in a day so we're gonna talk about that we're gonna talk about stuff getting these guys like uh, all my friends and getting around JP for the first time they didn't know him uh, and then it's just like he's a normal dude you know jokes has a good time picks on each other just normal guy stuff so that's what this podcast is about and this is about that community about that life about struggles about stories about persevering that's it we're going to talk about learned helplessness that's going to be a major focus in this thing as a society we've gone that way we do make we we basically have taught children to be learned helplessness it's just basically um, a condition that we've program children that they can't do things for themselves and and jp's gonna tell you all his stories about that and why he appreciates his parents and what they did and what they made him do um but that's that go, that's just one piece there's just a million different stories and so we want to hear everybody's stories i want to hear you guys bringing me the stories i want you emailing them to me i'm going to read them i promise i'll respond to each and every one of them i'm going to bring people on the podcast and and hear them uh, get their get their stories out. Get those motivational stories out. We're gonna do that. We're gonna do that. So that's our focus is for you guys. And I want to hear what content you want to hear, what stories you want to hear, what subjects you want to go over. Whether it's sex, toileting, you know, um, how you get dressed, uh, different equipment that's out there. We're gonna do product reviews. We're gonna show things. We're gonna do all kinds of cool stuff. So anything that you think that we need to do. You know, this is brand new. We kind of have a platform out, laid out. I built this studio in my garage. Sorry, there's a Yankees chair there. I'm not a Yankees fan. But um, I built this studio in my garage. Um, and we will um, be doing the podcast in here. We're pretty much done. Got to finish some wires up. That's a little messy. And... Uh, but we've got a microphone set up, set up for the guys, set up for my wheelchair users who come in. They can jump on the mic here. Um, if we have a couple of guys, say JP's here and another guy, um, we'll move this chair out and bring them in. That's what the studio looks like, small, compact, but perfect. And uh, um, we put some energy into this and uh, we're excited, man. That's vlog number one. Bye.